So you've done the self-help and you've dipped into some personal development, but now you ask the question, now what? What can you do? Well, if you want to escape the apathy, step right this way. So twice a year, I teach a course called Autonomy. It's a 12-week personal development and training course. What people get out of it is multifaceted. Uh, there's curriculum, there's exercises, there's camaraderie. You make new friends. There's a whole lot of interesting things. We're going to hear a sample from the course right now in its ongoing season. Let's take a look at the value these students are getting. There's a lot going on in the world. You guys had a little discussion today. That was nice. The regular discussion. Because you guys do need to talk to each other not just in breakout rooms. You know what I'm saying? The human connection is a very important part of the course. And I think it's one of the things that's left out of most other courses. Like you sign up for a course and you go through it by yourself and you don't talk to anybody. And then maybe you do something with that information. Maybe you don't, but a lot of courses, the way they're constructed, you can't easily integrate and make those skills part of your life. Because you guys get to know each other and you get to know yourselves and then you do these exercises over and over and then you level up and do the next exercises, that's what gives you the ability to have these skills for the rest of your life and to have dexterity, to be able to use them, to be able to like stop, think, oh, you let's use a tool. Let's not pound the nail in with our hand. Let's use the hammer. <laughs> and, and all too often, people don't think to reach for their tools. They just start doing stuff and then... They're not getting good results and then they get demoralized and then they quit. And that's where uh, everybody on this shelf would rather you stay frustrated, aggressive and quitting scarcity mentality, all that good stuff. So now we're working our way through those things. Most of you have shaken off a good bit of introversion and uh, even Carlos got a good workout yesterday. It wasn't his first time hosting do it live. But it was his first time like getting to his boundaries during Do It Live. And that's where the growth happens. And uh, there's been a couple meetings this week where we all got to the boundaries of our knowledge. And then we had to look some stuff up. And that was the real growth of that meeting. When we already know the answers and we're just the one thing, that's not really growth. That's just productivity. Productivity kind of ceases when you don't know how to cross that obstacle. And you got to stop. And it's like, okay, we got to look it up or get a tutorial or the, the piece doesn't fit. We got to order a new piece. All these sort of things are going to continue to happen. They are part of life. So we should know how to avail ourselves in, uh, of the tools we have and to marshal the resources to, to solve the problems. The faster we can do that, the more smoothly we can do that with uh, less frustration, less negative self-talk, less blame throwing. Uh, we're going to be more effective than everybody else who's out there not working on themselves, not trying to empower uh, their individual position and everyone else along the way, because there's a lot of politeness and creativity and inspiration and patience that get, gets like paid out into uh, the, the audience or the population that you're working around, you know, the, the social milieu. What are you spreading where you go? Are you spreading negativity and excuses? and you know not so great stories or are you spreading inspiration and enthusiasm and invigoration with your interactions out there everyone's doing some kind of self-help these days and you can find a million self-help courses out there most other courses out there are hosting lectures they're hosting videos they're maybe even doing q and a's and these are great starting points to encourage learning but at Autonomy, we believe that hands-on practice is the best way to really lock in what we're learning. There's no better way to gain confidence and mastery than through action. After each lecture, we practice the concepts we've learned with other students, giving and receiving feedback in a non-judgmental environment. The result is mastery of concepts like entrepreneurship, ethical sales, and self-reliance in an environment that directly translates to the real world. Plus, you make connections with other like-minded individuals who are learning right alongside you, and you have a lifetime membership in the community. The Autonomy Course with Richard Grove equips you with confidence, competence, and courage in a world filled with confusion and noise. You can learn more at getautonomy.info. We'll see you there.